Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. This is Anuta the Crochet World and if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please, please, please subscribe to my channel, like, share and comment on my videos and today we're going to do this beautiful pattern uh, for a small basket. Now this is a very small basket and um, this is a multi-purpose basket, basket. Basically I have made this one uh, just for a home decor and you can also use this one for your small things like your small keys or your accessories like earrings necklace you can put them in and it's a it's a nice add up in your home decor as well so for this one i've used my 100 percent cotton yarn and i've used my 4 mm of the hook so let's begin okay so for this one take your yarn and make your magic circle like this so for the magic circle just have your yarn around your fingers and make an axe here and put the second strain of yarn at the back now take your hook and insert your hook in this way grab your second strain of yarn through your first strain of yarn and turn your hook in this way and that's it this is your magic circle now for the round number one we're gonna have 12 double crochets into our first round now for that one i'm gonna chain up two one and two now this first two chain will count as our first double crochet and i'm gonna yarn over and will insert my hook into my this magic circle and will grab the yarn and will make my second double crochet and keep on doing your double crochets and we're gonna need 12 double crochets here including this chain two and i'm gonna meet you after my 12 double crochets and here it is i have my 12 double crochets and now i'm gonna pull my this loose end a little bit tight and now i'm gonna insert my hook into my this first double crochet so this is my chain two and i'm not gonna insert my hook into my this chain two rather i will go to this second double crochet here and that's my first proper double crochet and i'm gonna insert my hook in that stitch and will grab the yarn and will make my slip stitch here and that's how i'm gonna finish up my this first round round number one with 12 double crochets now for the round number two we're gonna chain up two and this chain two will count as our first double crochet and now yarn over and insert your hook again into that same stitch where you have made your slip stitch grab your yarn and make another double crochet here now into the next stitch we're gonna have another two double crochets and now we're gonna have two double crochets into each stitch and by the end of this round round number two we're gonna have our 24 double crochets so keep on doing two double crochets into each stitch and i'm gonna meet you after my 24 double crochets and here it is at the end of my round number two i have my 24 double crochets and now this is my first chain chain one and chain two and now i'm gonna insert my hook into my this second double crochet and we'll grab the yarn and we'll make my slip stitch here and this is how i'm gonna end my this round number two now for the round number three we're gonna chain up two one and two yarn over and insert your hook into that same stitch where you have made your slip stitch and grab your yarn and make your second double crochet now yarn over and insert your hook into a second stitch and grab your yarn and make one double crochet here now into the next one we're gonna have another two double crochets so that's our one double crochet and that's our second double crochet here on the next stitch you're gonna have one double crochet now keep on doing this keep on doing your two double crochets and then one double crochet two double crochets and then one double crochet and i'm gonna meet you after my this round round number three where i'm gonna have my 36 double crochets 36 stitches and i'm gonna meet you at the end here and here it is i have my 36 double crochets for my round number three and now i'm gonna insert my hook into my the second double crochet and we'll grab the yarn and we'll make my slip stitch here and that's how i'm gonna finish up my this round number three and now for the round number four now round number four is gonna be our last round and for that one i'm gonna chain one and as i've already worked on this one i've already made my chain one this chain one will count as my first single crochet now i'm gonna go to my this second stitch now here i'm gonna insert my hook into my this front loop only so instead of putting your hook 
inside both the loops like this just grab your front loop only and grab your yarn and make your single crochet and now we are going to do one single crochet on each stitch and all stitches will be front loop only and by the end of this round round number four we are going to have our 36 single crochets all back loop only and i'm going to meet you after my this round round number four with my 36 single crochets back loop only and here it is i have my 36 single crochets and now if you want to make this loop chain up 10 here if you don't want to make this loop it's going to be completely all right you can just simply insert your hook into your this fill stitch grab your yarn and make a slip stitch like this and finish up your work but if you want to make this loop just make your slip stitch and then chain up 10 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 and 10 and again insert your hook into that same stitch where you have made your slip stitch and grab your yarn and make a slip stitch there for one more time and that's how we're gonna make your loop now i've made this loop only to move it around if you, you have something in and you want to move it you can just simply grab your this loop and can move it here somewhere so here it is this is the end and now i'm gonna cut my yarn and i will secure my this last stitch and now put your this loose ends in and i'm gonna meet you after that and here it is your small basket is ready and i hope you have liked my this today's tutorial if you have liked please like share and comment on my videos and please 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 subscribe to my channel and i will see you into the next video till then bye